Well, my channel is primarily about fishing. I do quite a bit of shooting on the side, too. I've posted a few videos of that, uh, uh, quite a few in the past, uh, a few uh, more recently. And uh, for about four years, I've been shooting Precision 22 Rimfire, where we shoot small targets from anywhere from 25 yards out to 400 or more. And I wanted to post a, a video here showing some of that uh, recently from the Quantico Shooting Club. This is the first stage of a 10 stage match and most of these we're going to start with a rifle in hand and then move to a barrier. In this case we started on a barrier which was a uh, electrical spool. There are three targets, one at uh, one and a half inch, one six inch, and one four inch, all at 72 yards and we're taking uh, shots from three positions. The first position, the barrier, the second position. You had your choice of anything unsupported so you could stand, kneel, um, or uh, set. I chose to set and then the third position is off of this barrier here. So again 12 shots. In this particular case I made nine hits out of the 12 shots. Stage two has a shooting off of a barricade, uh, four positions. Uh, you move to the first position, shoot targets, second position, third position, and then move back to the second right, yeah. position for your fourth. There's a target T1 is a uh, small square at 126 yards, and T2 is a little lar larger square at 170 yards. This required one shot at each target from the first position, two shots at each target from the second position, one shot for each target from the third position, and then again, one shot from each target at the fourth position for a total of 10 shots. I scored 9 out of 10 on this stage. Stage 3 has a 2 inch IPSC at 77 yards, a 4 inch IPSC at 125 yards, and a 6 inch IPSC at 189 yards. The course of fire was to shoot T1 through T3 off of each of the three tips for the tank trap and then move to the prone position uh, for the last three targets for a total of 12 shots.
messed up a little bit on the tips on this one, but I managed 8 out of 12 on this stage. Stage 4 was the PRS barricade stage, and it's also the time stage. There's a 8-inch target at 160 yards and a 5-inch target also at 160 yards that you're shooting target 1 and 2 with a one shot from each position uh, and then move through 5 total positions. And, of course, it's the time stage, so you're trying to do it fast. Uh, but in my case, I was more concerned about making sure I hit all the targets and doing it absolutely fast. You're back. I did manage to get all the targets on this and uh, the timer didn't capture my ending so we went with 70 seconds. When I reviewed the footage it was about 63 but it really didn't make any difference. The next stage had two targets on the same post. One was a horizontal uh, target, the other was a vertical 6x2 and 2x6 at 75 yards and a third target at uh, 125 yards. It was a 4x5 and the uh, stage was to shoot each of the targets with one shot each uh, from several pillar positions. You had your choice of, of uh, six pillar positions. had a little trouble on a couple of the pillars, but I did manage 8 out of 12 on this stage. Stage 6 had uh, two targets at uh, 117 yards, a 2.5 inch and a 3.5 inch, and two targets at 130 yards, a 3 inch and a 2.5 and inch, and had us moving between two positions, two barricades. Shot twice from the bench, then you had to move to the far right side of the shorter bench and then move to the left side of that shorter bench for a tw total of 12 rounds. Impact. Good job. Impact. Impact. While my bipod setup worked well for the, uh, the the taller bench, it didn't Hang work up. real well for the lower one. It was getting hung up in the, the grooves there, and I was having trouble getting it stabilized and on target where I wanted it. Impact. 
with the troubles, I still managed 8 out of 12 on this stage. Impact. Stage 7 had a troop line of squares, 2-inch uh, at 96 yards, a 4-inch at 124, 6-inch at 168, and 8-inch at 206 that you shot off of uh, the ladder rungs. First uh, ladder rung was 1-4, to four, second ladder rung was 1-4, to four, and third ladder rung was 4-1 to one for a total of 12. In fact. Impact. Impact. Good job. Impact. 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 Manage 10 out of 12 on this stage. Two, two, two down. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't manage to get the footage on this or it got corrupted, but this was a uh, another spool that we were shooting off of, and we had five targets out there from shooting from five positions. You shot all five from the first position, then the largest four, then the largest three, then the largest two, then the largest one. Uh, it was a little bit challenging, but uh, but a fun stage. There were a total of 14 shots on this stage, and I managed to clean it. I said at the beginning that there were 10 stages. There were actually nine, and this is the final one. And again, I didn't get footage on this particular one, but it consisted of a couple of KYL racks, one at uh, 53 yards with really small targets, and one at 111 yards with slightly larger targets. Uh, the stage of fire was to shoot the largest target uh, at the close and then move to the largest target on the far and then alternate back and forth, moving down to lower targets, smaller targets each time. There were a total of 16 uh, targets, 16 rounds fired on this one, and I uh, managed to get 13 of the 16, which was the highest score on this particular one, so uh, very pleased with my results for it. At the end of the day, I didn't really expect this, but I did come in third in the match. I tied uh, for second place with number of hits, but the uh, the lady who beat me for second place had a better time on the PRS. She shot it about 45 seconds, which is why I said the 63 seconds up earlier really didn't have much effect on me. But uh, I am very pleased with my first podium finish. Uh, it took me four years to get here, uh, but I'm, I'm pleased with this result, and I look forward to, to shooting more in the future. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.